Hello guys, gagawa po tayo ngayon ng scone. Samahan niyo ko. Ang ating mga ingredients is self-raising flour, caster sugar, eggs, sultanas, optional, butter, baking powder, and a little bit of milk. So this is what we're gonna need. Mixing bowl, weighing scale, rolling pin, cookie cutter, measuring spoon, measuring cup, or you can actually use a mixer. It's optional. Pwede mo rin siyang i-mix sa bowl lang. First thing we have to do is to mix our dry ingredients in a large mixing bowl. Your flour, your sugar, and your baking powder. and add butter. For your wet ingredients, drop the eggs in a separate bowl. And add the milk on your dry ingredients later on. Next step, um, we will rub the butter with the flour. Mix all the dry ingredients. So all you have to do is to rub the butter with the flour. Break the butter into small pieces and incorporate it with the flour. See, dapat smooth siya. And as you can see, there's no more butter in there. Na-mix na siya with the flour. Next step, let's mix our wet ingredients. Mm, magtira tayo ng konti para sa um, washing in the end. Ay, egg wash natin siya. So, Mix it slowly, like this. Make sure you don't over mix it, kasi dun nagiging hard ang pastry. Add some sultanas. Uh, depends on how much you want, to be honest. But I want mine fruity, so I'll be generous. I'll put everything there. And then just mix it together. Next thing is dust to break surface with flour so so it's it, it will be ready for kneading oh. 
So, ito na yung pinakadaw natin. It doesn't need a lot of kneading. Very, very slight lang. Kasi ayaw natin maging matigas yung scone natin. Okay? That is actually a perfect dough. So, what we're gonna do now, i-roll lang natin siya ng konti. So, probably one and a half, ideally one and a half um, centimeter para meron siyang um, height. And then, we're going to need our cookie cutter. Obviously, our baking tray na meron ng baking paper ready. And then, we have different sizes in here. You can use the bigger one. But, I would say the middle one is the perfect size. Um... That we're gonna use today. I will dust it with flour para hindi dumikit yung dough. See, it's really sticky. So, kailangan mong i-dust lagi ang kamay mo. Okay? So, guys, your scum. Okay, so now, um, we will egg wash the scone. So this is the, the little bit of uh, wet mix that we left from earlier. Now, gagamitin natin siya para egg wash. So this is our scone. This is ready to go in the oven. Na egg wash na natin siya. And this is our preheated oven into 200 degree. Okay. Okay na. Give me a second. So this will bake for 20-25 minutes. It's better if you put the timer on. Para sure. But it's better if you keep checking kasi um, ovens are different. It may vary. So, okay. So, we just have to wait. This is our uh, finished product. Actually, um, nabake lang siya in 15 minutes. So, we have different um, sizes. Um, ilalagyan mo lang siya sa cooling rack to cool down a little bit before serving. I started making um, whipping cream para sa serving with our scone. So, um, it's nice with um, whipped cream and jam to serve. So, we have jam and whipped cream to serve or strawberry optional. You can serve it with anything you like. Enjoy!